Life is difficult at the bottom of the food chain. But luckily for the rabbit, it's over quickly. You know it's all fake, right? An easy meal for the faster, more powerful predator. What? His fake decided for it. Those documentaries. A chance to put up a fight. I mean, it's, it's all fake. It's all set up. Nothing more than sustenance of the left. Yeah, probably. Something to be devoured before it's useless. I like to watch him anyway. The predator moving on to find his next meal. It's unfortunate, but the rules of nature state it's survival of the fittest. Hey, neighbor! Bill? Amy? I'll see you tonight, okay? Stacy, super behind today. I need these inputted into the system and scan for errors by lunch. Well, that's not really my job. It's not? No. Dennis, you don't want to sit at this desk forever, right? No. Well, I'm the guy who makes the decisions on who moves up and who stays at little desk limbo. So, uh, do me a solid. It won't be forgotten. somebody to stay late and finish those up. I can't. What do you mean you can't? Well, isn't there somebody else that can do it? Everybody else has plans. Well, what if I have plans? Okay. <laughs> Attaboy. Lock up when you leave. How was your day? It was good. How was yours? Good. Um, I got some paint samples for the spare room if you want to look at them. Whatever you're doing there is okay with me. Okay. Oh, the, the sink was backing up again, so I think I'm going to call a plumber tomorrow. You don't have to do that. I'll do it. Are you sure? No. Yeah. I'll take care of it this weekend. state that there is a feasting order. The Alpha always eats first. No exception. It's a sign of dominance over the rest of the tribe. And any breaking of that order is dealt with quickly and violently. Any pass given is considered a sign of weakness. When he's eaten his fill, only then are the others alive. Uh. All right, I'm heading to bed. Oh, okay, maybe I'll join you. Okay.
Hey, what's up? Oh, um, I I'm sorry. I'll, I'll get you some more tomorrow, okay? Well, what am I supposed to eat? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Here, wait. You can have some toast. There you go. Toast? Hey, neighbor! Bill! Amy! Are we still on for the barbecue tomorrow? Uh, I don't know. I think uh, of course we're still on. Can't wait. Great. Love you. Yeah. Anything Do we really have to do this? Come on. It's gonna be fun. No, it won't. You know it won't. Okay. We've lived here for how long now? And we don't even know these people. It's gonna be fun to make some friends. Okay, I'll go get that, and you fire up the grill, okay? Uh. Hi! Potato salad. Oh, uh, hey, hey guys. Thank you so much for inviting us. It was so sweet of you. Look who I convinced to hang out with the cool kids. And Miss Brick? Oh, uh, uh, Ka Catherine, please. <laughs> Catherine? Mrs. Brick is fine. Whoa, hey, don't press down on him. It makes all the juices come out. And uh, hey, well, don't flip him over and over either. That's a myth about the even seer. I know how to cook a burger, Bill. Hey, I'm gonna be in Europe all summer, okay? This might be the last decent burger I get for a while, so I want it to be right. The whole summer? Yeah, yeah. You know, we're not getting any younger, right? I figure it's the right time. I had a couple good years financially, so I mean, I got the money, right? <laughs> you know, one of the best times I had in my life was this backpacking trip I took when I was in college. Oh, God, <laughs> the women. And they love Americans. So, uh, you're the adventurous type. Yeah, sure. Aren't we all? Guess not. What, you never wanted to try new things? Nope. Huh. Well, you better get on it, buddy. Life is gonna pass you by. So, Connor, are you looking forward to your trip? Yeah, I'm not going. No. Nah, he's headed to college in a couple years, so I figure it's time for him to have a little responsibility. You know? Hey, he's earned it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 4.0 GPA, top ranked wrestler in his class, right? Class president, I mean, you tell me. <laughs> the kid is perfect. <laughs> Schools are breaking down the doors already. He's gonna be a leader of men someday. Yeah. Hey, and uh, Amy and I would appreciate it if you keep an eye on more going. You know, just poke your head in once in a while, make sure he hasn't burned the house down. Sure. So if you ever wanna come over and hang out, you know? Play video games, whatever. Store's always open. Thanks. So, um, you need another beer? Don't ask me stupid questions. Hi. Is, uh, Connor here? Who? Connor. He invited me. Connor! Yeah, Connor, come on in! Okay. Connor? Yeah, Sarah? Nice. Can I get you a soda or something? There's burgers, it's almost done. No, okay, thank you. Well. Yeah, I mean, the, uh, the beaches in Europe are glorious, you know? The girls are all topless. <laughs> hey, you can kill it. Oh my god. Oh, burgers are done. I got it. What? Who's that? Huh? Oh. Friend of Connor's? I don't know. She's cute. Is she? Yeah. Lucky guy. Okay. So, you're starting to remodel? What? Mr. Beck. Uh, Dennis. <laughs> What's all this Mr. Beck stuff? Okay, Dennis. Do you mind if I go in the house and use the restroom? Uh, yeah, yeah, make yourself at home. Just, of course. I just didn't want to assume I could just go in.
Let me help you. No, that's okay. No, it's my pleasure. Um, okay. Thanks. So, Carol is pretty nice. Is she, uh, your girlfriend? Or... I just met her today. Really? You guys seem pretty familiar already. I mean, that's, that's why she's here. What? I met her on the hooked up app. That's the hooked up app. See, there's this app. You just upload a photo of yourself and a description of what you're looking for. And the girl likes what she sees. She just, you know. You like, fuck? Yeah, basically. No strings attached, just hooking up. This can't be real. It's very real. Well, what about, like, dating and, 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 and relationships? You know, making a connection. Aren't you interested in something like that? Yeah, maybe someday. But for now, we're all just looking for the same thing. Why waste time with anything else? Plus, better than watching porn. Right. You know what, call me old-fashioned. But maybe I want to know the person I'm sleeping with. You know? And then I couldn't just hook up with a stranger like that. Have you ever tried it? No. Well, then you don't know what you're capable of. We're basically just animals. Eat, fuck, and fight. It's all we know how to do. It's a little bit more complicated than that. Maybe, but I haven't seen it. It's purely physical and just sex after all. And there's no love to it or anything. It's not a big deal. What are you, like 12? You don't know what you're fucking talking about. Hey, are you ready? You're probably right. I don't know what I'm talking about. What? What's your problem? It's just that little punk kid. What's his name? Conrad. Connor? Yeah. You know, like, tried to be cool. Tried to be his friend. He was just so smug, you know? So arrogant. It was irritating. Really? The son of the world's most perfect parents? I find that hard to believe. You should have heard some of the things he was saying. <laughs> like what? Just never mind, okay? But that's just say that I should have popped him one. Okay. Um, well, can you, can you pop this back over to Amy for me? I'm serious. One punch, that's all I need. I'd knock him out.
Okay. Do you have a copy of the Matrix reports? Oh, uh, yeah, of course. Thanks. Can you give me a hand with these? I'm having trouble inputting them. Yeah, of course. doing oh you gotta be fucking kidding me still with us yeah we were talking about the sex app that you downloaded yeah do you want to talk about it I was just curious that's it I never cheated on you I swear then why did you download the app at all We've been married for a little while now, and things aren't exciting anymore. First got married, right? I mean, it was like I hit the jackpot. I mean, look, I, she was beautiful, and she was young, and she was into me. I couldn't believe it. I don't get lucky like that. But now... It's like she doesn't even care anymore. There's a whole world out there. Just wild stuff, crazy stuff, crazy sex stuff. I mean, it's all over the place, and our sex life is just... Wow. I feel like I'm missing something. We never do it anymore. When we do, it's like you're bored. I mean, do you even like it? Sometimes. But you don't act like it. Real girls don't have screaming orgasms like the ones in your videos. You don't think I know what you're doing in the bathroom every morning? God, you spend more time in there than I do. Well, you know what? It doesn't take a lot of time to not do your hair and makeup. Okay, okay. Well, why don't we just take a little breath here, okay? So, Dennis, do you watch pornography? Yes. What is it that compels you to watch these movies? It's release. Because it's satisfying. 
because it's sexy. God, I wish I could fuck like that. Like what? Savagely. You know, without consequences, just... I mean, nobody gets hurt. I mean, everybody's satisfied. It's perfect. It's amazing. You can have anything you want right when you want it. When I'm watching those movies, it's like I'm... It's like I'm watching everything that I will never be. And you can't have that with Catherine? Did you know that he felt this way? No. So clearly, this is not a sex issue. This is a communications issue. It can be really hard to express your needs to someone that you love. It can make you feel vulnerable. I mean, once it's out there, it's hard to take it back. Exactly. So I have something that just might help. What I want you to do is write down a fantasy, each of you. Keep it simple, start small. Put it in a box. And blindly pull one out. It'd be different, you know? You dressed up like that. But it's the same. It's always just the same. It's not you, okay? I just... I mean, maybe I just built it too big in my mind, you know? I just wanted something crazy and wild and just... I'm the one who fucked up, not you. What does that mean? I don't know. Just maybe... Maybe we're just not the kind of people that are meant for this kind of thing. Maybe we're just... boring. No. What? What are you doing? Are you telling me that I married a boring quitter. Okay, no, no, no. If that's you, then what does that make me? I didn't mean you. Listen, I'm not old and I'm not boring, okay? We're not boring. Say it, say we're not boring. We're not boring. I don't believe you. We're not boring. Oh, hello, somebody's back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Harder. Harder? Harder. Harder. Wait. No, don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Wait, no, 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 don't stop. Don't stop. Wait, no, again. Use this. Do it. Go. Go.
is that? It smells amazing. It's glass. And what is that? I don't know. I haven't tried it before. Oh, you're fancy. <laughs> Hey, Dennis. Looking good today. Do something new with your hair? Uh, actually, I've been working out lately. Like a lot. We'll keep it up. Mine too. Stacy! Get in here! I gotta go deal with that. Can you step into my office, please? You wanted to see me, sir? Uh, yeah, I've been uh, going over your work here, and uh, it's unacceptable. Oh, no, I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. I did the best that I could. Well, I'm afraid that the best that you could isn't good enough. I'm gonna have to fire you. Oh, please, please don't fire me, sir. Is there anything that I can do? I'm sorry. Nothing I can think of. You're fired. There's nothing that you can think of? There might be something. On. I came to check it out. Yeah, ain't nothing happening back here. Let's go! Well, somebody was in here. There wasn't a fucking tornado in my office. Proof! I'm looking right at it. Yeah? Well, maybe you should get better security guards, asshole! Hey, Dennis, I'm gonna need you to take care of this for me today. I'm just not up for it. No. Excuse me. No. Got my own stuff to do. I can't be carrying you two. Please. You couldn't handle my job. What? Playing with my phone all day. Pushing my work onto everybody else. I can handle your job. Well, what if I was to write you up, huh? What if I was to fire you? For what? Insubordination. Insubordination. You filed that report with HR, and you explained to them why I'm being insubordinate for not doing your fucking job. Back to work. It was like something out of a movie. I'm so worked up right now. Can you feel my heart beating? <laughs> I just want to... Here, come on. Let's do something out of a fantasy box right now. Something wild. Um, no. I was thinking that we could slow it down for a little bit. Slow it down? Slowing it down is the exact opposite of what we should be doing right now. I've never felt like this before. I don't want to stop now. This is when we push it, push it as far as we can. 
I'm gonna drive this car off a fucking cliff. No consequences. Hey, Connor. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Baker. I'm sorry I haven't stopped by lately. You know, I told your dad that I'd be looking after you. It's all good. I don't need anyone to look after you. No, me. I know that. I don't think you're a child. I just didn't want you to think that I had abandoned you. That's it. It's all cool, really. OK. You know what? Why don't you come over this afternoon? I... Yeah, we'll order out. It'll be great. I can't. I got plans. Oh. Well, that's too bad. Actually, <laughs> I know my parents asked you to check in on me and all, but I was going to invite a couple of friends over tomorrow night. You mean like a party? Well, not a party, just like a couple of close friends, just hanging out, you know? Figured you'd be cool with it. Oh, yeah, I'm cool with it. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm cool with it. No awesome. Problem. Just don't want anyone calling the cops on me or anything, you know? Yeah, I don't want to ruin my parents' vacation. <laughs> yeah, I know. Some of the neighbors are kind of lame. Listen, have it at my house. What? Yeah, we'll use the pool, we'll grill out, it'll be perfect. Really? Yeah, that way I can keep an eye on you. You know what I mean? No one's going to call the cops at my house. Um, I, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't want to be like an inconvenience to y'all or anything. Uh, are you sure Mrs. Brick's cool with it? What, Catherine? <sighs> Catherine's cool with it, man. Uh, you know what? I insist. Yeah, if you're having the party, you're having it at my house. Okay, I guess. All right. Thanks. Sure. Hey, it's better this way. Trust me. To relax. How am I supposed to relax? There are children drinking alcohol in my house right now. Like this. What, have you brought out a fun? No, come no, on, come on, just one shot. Please? <sighs> come on, one more. <clears throat> one more. One more. Just one more. Well, after Connor told me that you personally extended your rotation, how could I say no? Uh, come in. There's food and drinks. Just make yourself at home. You all right? Huh? Are you all right? You looked a little stressed out. <laughs> Is it that obvious? Look, I can get all these people out of here if that's what you want. Oh, no. No, that's that's not necessary. You sure? It's not a problem. Yeah, I mean, Dennis is having fun, so it's fine. What about you? What about me? You having fun? Not exactly. Yeah, me either. Aren't these your friends? What? I thought you knew them. <laughs> You know, you're allowed to enjoy yourself every once in a while. Oh, I, I know. I've just had a lot on my mind lately. Like what? You don't want to know. OK. Well, tell me something I do want to know. Like what? I don't know. Anything. Whatever you want. Did Dennis send you over here to talk to me? No. Why would he do that? Never mind. <laughs> Wait, you're telling me that you're a cheerleader? Really? What about that is so hard to believe? I don't know. I just... Cheerleaders always just seem so... prissy. Really? I'm glad you came. I think I was going to get to see you again. Yeah, well, from what I've heard, you've seen quite a bit of me. No, 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 it's okay, really. It's it's fine. Kind of liked it. Really? I mean, yeah. Never done that before. You know, had somebody watch me. Chalk it up to new experiences. Gotta keep it fresh. It was definitely hot, though, being watched. Really? 
Mm, yeah, I can add it to my profile. Exhibitionist. Well, you see, there's this app. Oh, I, I know about the app. <laughs> you do? Yeah, I um, signed up for it. <laughs> you scoundrel. <laughs> yeah. Wait, does, does Catherine know? Yeah. Hey, we're cool. You know, I mean, we're married, but we still party. Lucky dog. Graduation's a couple years away. Oh, that, that's exciting. I guess. <laughs> I mean, it'd be nice to finally get out of here. I just don't know what I want to do with my life. Well, you know, I graduated many years ago now, and um, I still don't know what I want to do with my life either. But that's life, though. You just try new things, and if you don't like it, you can move on to something else, so. Yeah. Like, my dad wants me to go to college, of course. And, but why? What's the point? Everyone goes to college. But you have to go to college. Why? You went to college, right? Yes. What'd you study? Social work. Why? Because I wanted to help people. See, that's awesome. I want to make a difference too, you know? I don't want to be locked down in some job that I hate forever or obsess about things like my house or my lawn. Well, what do you have in mind then? I was thinking about joining the Peace Corps. Oh, that, that's so admirable. I mean, it's actually really nice hearing someone your age thinking about more than like likes and followers and shares. Yeah. It's cool. Well, I think you're cool. <laughs> seriously, <laughs> seriously, I, I can't talk like this in front of my friends. Okay, um, well, I need another drink, so. This is fun. I'm glad you came. Me too. So you're good to drive, right? Because you could totally crash here. I have a futon in the spare room. No, thank you, but really, I had fun. Okay. One too many. I'm gonna go ahead and head to bed. Can I help clean anything up? No. Just leave everything there. I'll clean it up in the morning. You sure? Yeah. He's a good guy. Oh, yeah. He's a great guy. Well, thanks for letting us party over here. Hopefully we didn't mess things up too much. Oh, no. Maybe I should start getting my friends out of here. Or at least the ones who are still awake anyways. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I would rather you guys just stay here than be out trying to drive right now, so. Oh, OK, then. It's really nice talking to you. I guess I'll just see you around. Um, actually, I have something to show you. You want to come with me? Yeah. What's going on? You all right? Oh. 
Yeah. Hey. Are you taking a shower? I was about to, yeah. Oh. Um, maybe I'll join you. Uh, no. I'm not really feeling up to it. Kind of under the weather, you know? Oh. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. It's almost ready. Um, well, you remember that cool Filipino market we went to? I got some taquino. Um. It's all right. Is this all right? Yeah. Well, if you don't like it, I can, I can make you something else. You know, I, I also got some- No, you know what? Can you just give me some, like, cereal or something? Oh, you don't want that. They've been in there for weeks now. It's stale. I, I really don't mind making you something. It's fine. Really? Oh, okay, okay, that's what you want. Is everything okay? It's fine. This is exactly what I wanted. Dennis? Dennis! Mm. We're getting a little behind out here. I was thinking about asking somebody to stay. Um, yeah, I'll stay. Really? Yeah, that's, that's fine. I'll do it. I don't have anywhere else to go tonight. Okay, yes. <clears throat> See, it says here that you have to go to college. That's if I want to be a boss or something. I'm just looking to be a grunt for now. What's going on? Oh, hey! Um, I, Connor and I were just going over the requirements for the Peace Corps. Hey, Dennis. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. You said you were going to be late, and I didn't want all this food to go to waste, so I... Without you? No, no. There should be enough left for you. Sorry. I, I guess I got a little carried away. I've just been working out so much lately that I've been hungry all the time. <laughs> Oh no, I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't realize it was all gone. Oh, with that young metabolism, you have to enjoy it while you can. <laughs> Suddenly, a new line makes a play for the Alpha. There will be no negotiations here. A fight is inevitable. They clash in a brutal display of violence and aggression unmatched anywhere else in nature. They both know what is at stake. The loser Dennis! off into the wilderness to die a yeah. lonely, painful Why don't you turn off the TV for a minute and come in here? I'm with the dominant female. I'm in the middle of this. Well, I think I have something you like more. Oh, oh yeah, 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 you're, you're, your house is you're so dirty. Oh, oh, yeah, you shit. You like it like that? Oh, oh, okay. Is, every, is everything all right? Yeah, it's fine, it's just... Okay. Just distracted, that's all. Okay. Um, well, maybe, maybe I can, um... No, just... You know what? To tell you the truth, this, this isn't doing it for me. Oh, um... Okay, uh... Well, it... It was in the box. Yeah, well, it's just not working. Maybe just change. Okay. Dennis. 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 What? 
What is going on with you? Your performance no, I, here lately. Excuse me for a second. I don't feel very well. Sweetie, you're home early. Actually, I have something I have to talk to you about. What's up? What's he doing here? Oh, Connor is fixing the pipe underneath the sink. It's all good under here. You shouldn't have any more problems with her. With her? The sink. Later. So, what did you need to talk to me about? Nothing. I just didn't feel very well. I had to leave early, that's all. Oh, well, you look a little flush. You don't feel warm, though. Yeah, it's probably nothing. Okay, um, well, why don't, why don't you have a seat and I'll make you some tea, okay? Okay? Okay. So Connor fixed the sink. Yeah, it looks like it. No more backups then? Nope. Sounds pretty handy. I suppose. So did you call him or did you just? No, no, I, I just, I ran into him randomly outside. I must have mentioned it and he, he volunteered to come over and help. Yeah, you just. Randomly met him outside. Yeah, randomly. I could have fixed that sink. I just, I've just been busy, that's all. I know that. It's just a sink. It's not very hard. I could have fixed it. The trunkfish is a strictly monogamous species. The females pair with a male, lay their eggs, and wait patiently for their partner to fertilize. However, sometimes, once the eggs are laid, a different male, taking advantage of a vulnerable situation, secretly fertilizes the eggs himself, producing a cuckold in the process. The new male's legacy will live on, while the monogamous male's lineage, sadly and unbeknownst to him, comes to an end. I don't know what to do anymore. It's like, since he got laid off, he just wants to sit around the house all day on his phone. Yeah, it's gotta be hard, losing his job at his age. Okay, I know, I know we probably seem ancient to you. We're not that old. <laughs> well, you're not. You're super chill. Dennis. I, I, he just tries too hard. Not everyone can be perfect like your parents. My parents? <laughs> you think that fucking Dylan Amy's my mom? Pillowhead? Yeah, it's a dude's third wife. Third? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> Trust me. Parents are far from perfect. Connor, start spending any more time here. We'll have to start charging you rent. Yeah, I was about to head out anyways. Good. Yeah, good. Later, Kathy. Kathy.
You two seem to be getting pretty close. But he's a nice kid, and he's just looking for a little guidance. His parents aren't giving it to him. And I think that he sees us as, like, you know, contemporaries. Us? Or you? He has a ton of respect for you. He talks about you all the time. I bet he does. I bet he's just touting my names, nibbling on your ear. I don't want you hanging out with that kid anymore. Okay, if you don't want Connor over here anymore, I get it. Okay? Can, can we make up now? Just not in the mood. No? Not at all? No. We can pull something out of the box if you want to. Stop it. What, what, what's the matter with you? I'm fine. You're, n you're not fine, Dennis. You won't, you won't touch me. Like, you won't, you won't even look at me. I knew this was gonna happen. I knew, I, I knew this was gonna happen. Look, I'm fine, okay? Really, I'm fine. You know what? I got a new idea for us. What, what is it? It's something I've been dying to try. Okay, okay, well, um, just, just put it in the box. No, now. We have to do it now. We have to do it now. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is gonna be, this is gonna be just how you've always wanted it. No, just, 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 what? I thought that's what you wanted. You're fucking sick. I'm sick. I'm not the one who fucked the child. What is it about this kid? I want to know why he can make you come and I can't. I mean, what is it about this kid? It makes you hug so hard. He treats me like I'm a fucking human being, not just a fucking hole to shove things into him. That's what you wanted. You knew what you were asking me to do. You wanted to do it. You know you wanted to do it and you did it. And you liked it more than you liked it with me. If you have any regrets, that is your fault. I can't even look at you anymore. Just get the fuck out! Yeah? Get the fuck out! Just get the fuck out of my house! Fuck, fuck, fuck you! Fuck you. Fuck out. Cheer practice just started for the summer, so it's been taking up a lot of my time. Yeah, I don't think I've seen you since the party at my house. I think you're right, actually, yeah. That was a crazy night, huh? Did it, did it get crazy? Yeah, things got pretty wild. You should have stuck around. Oh, I, okay, cool. Yeah, it was, uh, it was filled with those new experiences you like. You know what I'm talking about? I'm sorry? Remember? When we were talking about new experiences? Remember? New experiences? New experiences? How's this for you? Whoa, what the fuck? Wait, what? I thought that you were into this. I thought that you were No, into you? No, but you're crazy. You act all sexy. You acted all interested. You acted like you're into it. And then if I put out, you don't give me anything. Oh, you're a fucking complete stranger. That is none of your business. Fucking slut. I'm a slut? Yes. Really? Get the fuck out of here. You're an old man coming up to the high school trying to find little girls to prey on. Really? What the fuck? I wonder how your wife would feel about that. Let's see how your wife likes that. Oh, 
get to pretend like you didn't do anything. Like nothing's wrong. Nothing is wrong. You knew what this is about, Inish. You've got a problem. That's your fucking problem. You ruined my life. Fight me. What? You have to fight me. Why? Because that's the way that it works. Those are the rules. Look, my parents are on the way home right now. And they're definitely gonna fuck up all our shit if they heard what happened! You have to fight me! <laughs> How about instead, I call the cops and tell them that your wife fucked the 16-year-old while you recorded it! We can forget any of this ever. You can't just do whatever you want! <sighs> Wasn't supposed to be like this. Wasn't supposed to be like any of this. 